The overall goal of this procedure is to generate subcutaneous or intrahepatic human hepatocellular carcinoma, or HCC, xenografts in immunodeficient mice. This is accomplished by first preparing tumor fragments or a single cell suspension from a fresh human HCC specimen for implantation into the mice. For subcutaneous xenografts, the next step is to inject tumor cells or to implant tumor fragments into a subcutaneous dorsal pocket. For intrahepatic xenografts, the next step is to inject tumor cells into the spleen or liver or to implant tumor fragments directly into the liver. In the final step, the animals are observed for several weeks until tumors develop. Ultimately, the human HCC xenografts can be used to study many aspects of tumor biology, including the mechanisms of tumorigenesis and responses to novel therapies. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods, like the use of cell lines or subcutaneous xenografts only, is that with this technique the primary human liver cancer specimens and patient-derived intrahepatic xenografts provide a more realistic biological model of human hepatocellular carcinoma. Demonstrating the procedure will be Sharif Ahmed, a postdoctoral research scientist from my laboratory.